Hey what is up guys, welcome back to another Minecraft RTX video. Today we're going to check out another Minecraft RTX shader texture pack for Minecraft Windows 10 aka Minecraft Bedrock and this one is actually called the NVIDIA PBR Pixel Art with Blockworks texture resource pack for Minecraft Windows 10 and it's actually made by NVIDIA which is really cool because those guys are behind the whole RTX scene with Minecraft and they're also well known for making their RTX graphics cards as well so I was quite interested to try and see what this RTX shader texture pack would be like especially because it's created by NVIDIA okay so as you guys can see it does look similar to the vanilla RTX experience so that was to be expected so you can see the reflections there in the water obviously looks quite nice and you can also see the uh, sun's reflection there in the water as well as expected in the uh, vanilla RTX experience the sun over there and the clouds you can see there more square shaped However, the reflection is rounded in the water there. Just go underwater. You can see the rays coming in. Looks quite cool. Another cool thing about this is the glass, which I noticed. As you guys can see, this is the uh, stained glass. I do like the borders and the effects they've got going on here. Looks quite nice. Obviously, we do have the, the sun's rays coming in through that colored glass and onto the grass there as well. And you do actually have reflection going in the glass as well. So if you guys can see, I'm looking up there and we can see the, the grass is reflection going in there. As you can see in there, that corner over there looks quite cool. The ores are quite interesting in this one. They do glow as well. As you can see there. Obviously, you can see the uh, reflection there of the ores on that glass tile, as I mentioned earlier. So, a nice effect they've got going on there as well. And then we've got the lanterns there glowing onto the glass as well. You can see the reflections there. If we head over here towards the lava. You can see some reflection going on there. And this is actually a reflective terracotta block. And we've got the glass there as well, and we've got the reflection of the lava on the glass. I've also noticed that there is uh, some fog elements as well, as you can see. And the grass is different to the standard grass. It's got that textured effect going on there. And as you would expect with the vanilla RTX experience, we do have the standard shadows as well. So overall, if you're looking for a vanilla experience and you want to check out the RTX elements of the game, I would recommend this. Obviously, you would need a RTX compatible graphics card, and I would recommend something like the RTX 2060 or higher. And you do need a full working Minecraft Windows 10 account as well to use the shader pack. And the good thing is that you can download this directly from the NVIDIA's RTX website for Minecraft. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you guys how to actually download this and then install it 
on your game and that will allow you to create your own world in Minecraft Windows 10 and enable the ray tracing features in the game. Let me just quickly show you the resource pack as well, details. So if we go to settings, global resources, if I go into active, you can see this one is called NVIDIA PBR Pixel Art with Blockworks resource pack. And if we go to video on your default Minecraft Windows 10 installation, if you go to video settings, you'll notice that the ray tracing slider is actually disabled and there'll be like an information icon here. And if you hover over that information icon, it will tell you that the only way to play with ray tracing turned on is to actually download a world which is RTX compatible from the marketplace. And those worlds are actually made by NVIDIA. So what they want you to do is go into the marketplace, search for NVIDIA, and you can download one of these worlds and then you can actually play in those worlds with RTX and ray tracing turned on but you won't be able to create your own world and enable RTX. So using this texture RTX shader pack, you should be able to create your own world and enjoy these RTX ray tracing elements that you're seeing right now. All right, so I'm gonna now show you guys how to download this and then install it. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is if you open up your internet browser, just type in Minecraft NVIDIA RTX. All right, so if we scroll down a bit, there will be a link here that says Minecraft with RTX PBR texturing guide. So if you wanna click on that, and then it will take you to the main NVIDIA website which talks about Minecraft with RTX. And it actually tells you how to create your own texture pack. But if we scroll down, As you can see this bit here, NVIDIA and partner resource packs. And this bit here, it says NVIDIA has also released a new resource pack that's compatible with the latest version of Minecraft with RTX and has been updated February the 2nd, 2021. So all you need to do is just click on this bit here that says download here. And if you just double click the file, it should automatically be installed for use in a game. It will be a .mc pack file. So let's go ahead and download this. And it's a small file, it's nothing big, so it should be done fairly quick. All right, so once the file has downloaded, as you can see, I've placed my file on the desktop there. So I've got the NVIDIA PBR final.mc pack file. And it's really easy to install this, guys. All you need to do is just double click on this file and it will start importing it into the game. And then you should get a message that says successfully imported. And when you're installing texture packs, only ever open a .mc pack file. All right, let's go ahead and install this. So as you can see, it's loading the game. And then I should get a message on the top there that says import. There we go. And as you can see, it says successfully imported NVIDIA PBR pixel art with Blockworks. All right, now if we go to settings, and if we go to video, and as I mentioned earlier, you can see that the ray tracing slider is turned off. And if we hover over this information icon here, it says this can only be played in a ray tracing capable world. Now, if we go to global resources, click on my packs. So what we're looking for is this one, which is called NVIDIA PBR Pixel Art with Blockworks. Click on that. Click on activate. There we go. As you can see, it's been activated and it's showing in the active section now. So you should have two there showing. So you will have the default Minecraft texture pack. And on top of that, you will have the NVIDIA PBR pixel art with Blockworks texture pack as well. All right, let's just go back. And now if we go to settings and then video, you can see the ray tracing slider is now turned on. And I've got that set to 24 chunks. If you do want to disable it, go back to global resources, click on this, and click on deactivate. If you want to completely delete it from your game, go to storage, click on resource packs, look for where it says the NVIDIA name, this one, 
and the video PBR pixel art. Click on that and then you can click on this bin icon which will completely get rid of it from your game. All right, let's go back. Now let's try creating a new normal world, survival world. Keep all the settings as default. All right, let's go and create this. And as you guys can see, we are now in a normal survival world. And as you can tell immediately from the reflections there and the shadows that the RTX elements have been turned on. And I am using the NVIDIA shader texture pack, as you guys can see here. So you can tell from that fog lighting, sun's reflection down there looks really nice so yeah if you guys found this video useful please do give us a like if you have any questions or comments about this texture pack leave them in the comment section below and also please do subscribe to this channel to help support to help it grow and thank you for watching